Hi guys, it's your girl Natalie, the One True Diamond, coming at you with my Sunday. Mm, this afternoon now, because it's 2 o'clock in the afternoon. My I Sunday afternoon. We're making a video. This is my Sunday afternoon chit chat. I see too. I see too, <laughs> you see too? Yeah. Well, wave and say hello. Say hello, you two. Say hello, you two. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> we're making a Sunday afternoon chit chat. Yeah, baby, I am. I had to come across town while Derek gets dressed and um, pick up a cake. I know I wouldn't need that cake that his aunt is making for us. So I'm going to pick up a cake his aunt is making for us and then. We are all three going out to dinner and then take Princess Jewel home, home, home. Hey. If I hear one more time, she's trying to speak now. Hey, they say hey. <laughs> yeah. If I hear one more time, it's not dark anymore. I can go home. <laughs> it has been a weekend to remember. She is actually not been much trouble at all. But I strolling out toys and things like that all over the floor yeah that's about the worst thing that I can say she has done and me and her had to pick those things up okay so um, I think that's about the worst thing yes no. yes after you eat you got to get something to eat first what you want to eat You don't want nothing to eat? Okay, well, we'll get it. You can take it home. She got something at home. Did y'all hear that? Okay. Whatever. Oh, God, she is a mess and a half. But anyway. Um, yeah, that's one thing I can say. She misses it. She's glad to be going home. Home, home, home. So, yeah. She's ready to leave her Grammy. We had some fun this weekend, though. Um, we stayed in most of the weekend. But I will say we did have some fun. Um, God, there's a lot of state troopers on this road today. A lot, a lot of stuff. I just passed two. You don't usually see state troopers on this road. Very seldom do you see a state trooper on this road. It's the highway. Well, I'm headed the opposite way, though. But this is a highway that I usually um travel going to work and y'all know most of the time I'm speeding. Uh-uh, leave that door alone and sit back, Jordan. Locked. Yes, the door's locked. I want it locked. Thank you, ma'am. Okay, but um today I'm not gonna do any couponing today, I don't think. I know you see the water? Yeah. Okay. Yes, yeah, water. water. She gets excited about water. But um, but I um, since I have not really looked at anything, I seen some deals. As I did scroll Instagram. Let me take that back. I scrolled Instagram this morning, and there was a few deals on um, some things at CVS that I thought about that I might do, but I'm not sure if I'll do them or not. I'm not. I'm not feeling really couponing. Like I said today, I'm just gonna go get something to eat and then take her home. And um, I'm thinking about. Um, I see. I'm, I just gotta get home and finish downloading my, um, or not downloading, but submitting my recertification. Now that I got all my points, I did them all on Friday, and I need to. Um, work on my plan with me and start doing something. I don't know if I'll meal prep because I have just been so conformed to like cooking every night. It's so hard to meal prep when I'm meal prepping for two. I, I don't know why I can't do, do it. I mean, I could do it perfectly well for myself, but it's like I feel like I don't want to cook too much. But I don't know. So I've been one. I've been pretty much basically cooking every night something. Now, well, some nights we might eat some leftovers if I do too, too much. But most of the time, I am 
whatever. I ain't, mm, I'm getting tongue tied. Most of the time, I'm cooking something every single night. Yeah. So, and whatever I cook the night before, I will, excuse me, I'll take it for lunch the next day. So that's kind of how my meal prepping has been going. I cook Mama, enough. Yes. You gonna take me home? Yes, I'm gonna take you home. I'm gonna take you home. You are going home. Woo! Can we say hallelujah? Whoa! <laughs> you talking about your grandma driving? Oh. What are you whoaing for? I am not. Uh -huh. That's me. Anyway, guys, I'm not going to keep you up here. I you just want to fart. check in. It's on Sunday afternoon. Yeah, I did not. You stop saying that, little girl. Oh, my God. <laughs> She's at that stage with stuff like that. It's funny. It's not funny. She's probably the one who just did it. <laughs> She is a mess. But anyway, I'm going to go for now. I will see you guys later. Just remember to do what? Give God some praise. Give him some thanks for waking you up this morning. Starting you on your way. And give you another chance to get it right. And you guys, I don't know if y'all remember, but I was just talking about how I have been praying to God to um, open up a door where I can see Princess Jewel. Because y'all know I hadn't seen her since before Christmas. And I just said, okay, I'm going to ask you know, because the word tells us we have not because we ask not. So I asked, and then, you know, I had talked with her mom, and, you know, I know God worked through her mom to talk to her, to tell her to let me keep her for the weekend, and I got back in okay. So, yeah, so that was just it right there. I was excited all week long. I didn't say anything to y'all until Friday morning chit-chat because, I don't know, not like jinxing myself, but, you know, I just didn't want to have to go through the disappointment if it didn't happen. And then I'm all disappointed, and then I got to come back on and see how I'm disappointed because I didn't get her. But, you know, God worked it out. He opened up a door. I am so thankful and so grateful for him for doing that. So, anyway, guys, I'm really going to get off here for now. I will see you guys in the next video. This is just something to encourage someone to say, hold on, no matter what it looks like, no matter how many no's you get. Just keep holding on, keep believing, keep having the faith. And eventually, you know, you're going to get a yes. You know, God answers us in so many ways. I know I keep trying to get off here. It's either no, that's not for you, not at this time, or yes. And it, you know, it's just those clear statements. It's not no gray areas or maybes or might, no. It's either no, that's not for you, to wait, <laughs> wait on it, and three, yes. You're either going to get us instantly yes or a wait, wait, not at this time, not for you, hold on. You're going to get all those kind of wait things, okay, or either you're going to get a flat out no. <laughs> I said no, <laughs> and the no and the wait is not so pleasant guys y'all already know that but there is benefits in the way and i'm gonna leave it at that i'm not gonna preach today i will talk to you guys later in the next video as always do what give god his praise i'll talk with you later bye